Two-thirds of us say that we are frustrated or stressed out by how disorganized we are at home. You've probably seen best-selling author and organizational guru Peter Walsh on Oprah. And this morning, he'll tell us about a new Organize This contest. It comes with a $20,000 makeover from California Closet. And I hear a visit with Peter himself. Good morning, Peter. Hey, Evan. Good morning. How are you doing? Uh, very good, sir. So is that right? The grand prize is that makeover it's, and then a visit with well, you? Well, it's... It's very exciting and very scary, depending on your perspective. Um, <laughs> you know, I spend most of my life traveling the country, helping people organize their homes. And one of the greatest challenges facing people, believe it or not, is organizing their closets. And so I've teamed up with California Closets for the Organize This competition. And if you go to um, facebook.com slash California Closets, we're giving away actually up to $50,000 of home storage solutions and for the first prize winner I will come to your home to help you declutter and organize your scariest spaces. Very good. So great prizes there. We've got a link at 13WM.com if our viewers want to check out that contest. And you know, Peter, for people who don't know what a California closet is, what is the concept and the idea behind it? Well, the, the idea is that a little organization goes a long way in organizing your home and your life. And I've seen that you can't make your best choices, you can't make your healthiest choices in a cluttered, messy, disorganized home. So the whole idea is basically to get people to look at how their homes are disorganized and to really get a little motivated, and the contest helps enormously, to really get their homes and their lives back in shape. I'm looking over your shoulder and I'm seeing yeah. what, what I really like about California closets is we often think in our closet we've got floor and we've got a hanging rack and that's all we got. Whereas California closets, they kind of make great use of space, don't they? Well, you know, it, it's interesting that, you know, this organization I'm pretty happy to work with because excitingly, it's not just about closets. It's about, you know, any functional space in your house, be it the garage, your home office or the closet. Here's an opportunity to look at all of those areas in your home and get both California Closets and me in there to help. And if you actually go to the Facebook page, you'll be able to see a ton of examples already of people who've entered. They've taken a photo, they've uploaded it, and they've gotten their friends and family to vote for them. And so it really gives you an idea of the, the whole array of spaces that people are struggling with. Peter, when we meet people who have had to lose weight, for example, they sometimes have trouble keeping it off. When we meet people who have organizational issues, I imagine yeah. they may have trouble keeping the clutter out, even when they finally get organized. So you work with a lot of people. Have you found that once they make that move towards sort of kind of getting it all uncluttered and organized, they're able to maintain that, or do they sort of relapse? You know, it, it depends on how they approach organization. If you focus on the stuff, you will never get organized. The starting point in making changes with your clutter and organization is to first ask yourself, what is the vision I have for this space? What do I want from this space? And then start asking, do the things I own help me create that space, help me create that vision, or do they move me farther away from it? And so I've found that people backslide if it's just about moving stuff around, but if it's asking about quality of life and how your things create that, I find that permanent long-term change is really possible. Yeah, that's great stuff. And just under a minute left here, uh, do you find that we have too much stuff? And I'm not saying we're all hoarders. I mean, that's sort of a, lo a big leap there, but do we have too much and can we most of us stand to get rid of some of the things we've got? Yeah, you know, I, I, it's an interesting point and I think many of us have bought into the idea that more is better. And I think that's been a real problem in our country and I think that the current situation is helping people realize that happiness is more about the quality of our relationships than it is about the quantity of our stuff. And I think once people start thinking in that way, that it's not about the kid with the most toys ruling the sand pit. It's really about just how the things I own can help me improve the quality of my life. I think that can really turn people's lives around. Yeah, it's liberating. All right, Peter Walsh, thanks for your time. It's the Organize This Contest with California Closets. Much more information on 13WM.com. Have fun with that, Peter. We'll see you again soon. Thanks, Evan. All right, much more to come at 13WM News this morning. Weather forecast. 
Coming up next, we look ahead to the weekend.